Okay, I guess the grand question in the room is this. Well, I know what most people are saying. You shouldn't have hopped this big ass on there anyway. Let me, I got something for that. No, I'm gonna blame the stove. You wanna know why? Because although they probably don't sell a lot of beds, it just looked like it was in like Macy's or something like that or in Dillard's upstairs, y'all know how it go. And it just happened to be a bed there. And the thing what I want to say is this, that is 100% the store's fault. The reason why I would say that is because when you got a bed, right? When you got a bed and it's on display, you got to expect that people, a bed, a couch, those type of things, you got to expect that people are going to hop their behinds on it and they're going to test it out. So somebody put on the caption and said, congratulations on buying your new bed. Yeah, <laughs> me. I ain't buying shit. Got me fucked up. Uh, when it comes to that bed breaking, I get up, run to the parking lot or speed walk to the parking lot and drive off and I won't return back to that mall for I say for a good three months. A good three months. Maybe half a year at that. Cause, you know, although they not gonna track them down, but I would've got up out of there, I ain't paying for nothing. I ain't paying for nothing I truly don't want. So, the fact they got a bed there that couldn't even hold up his weight, that's a problem. It ain't him, it's the stove. Cause when we go to these mattress places and these places that got beds and everything, that don't never happen. And if you break it, it's the stove fault. This on your property. This your display, your workers put it together. All I did was, 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 was do what customers do, try things out. And it just happened to be on display. Things that are on display are to be touched, are to be used. Unless you got a sign saying, do not hop on here. Do not touch this. Other than that, I ain't paying for nothing. Not at all. Mm -mm. He ain't in the wrong, man. Is he in the wrong? What y'all think? Do y'all really think this man is in the wrong? I don't think he's in the wrong. I know he's not in the wrong, but we're here to see what y'all think as well. So what are y'all thoughts about this right here? Check it.